Hello. Uh, welcome to Japanese Craft Beer Reviews. Today is not a Japanese Craft Beer Day. It's not even a Craft Beer Day. Uh, uh, in recent video we looked at a beer called Eurohop, which was a, a contract brew for a Japanese uh, uh, kind of import store. And today we're going to look at another one, which is this. It's called Engelchen. And this is also made uh, a contract brewed for the Japanese market. And it's also commonly found at the same store as Eurohop, uh, which is called Kaldi Coffee. Kaldi with K. K-A-L-D-I Coffee. And it's a, a kind of uh, import store. Uh, which uh, is often found in shopping malls uh, throughout Japan and Engelchen is the place where you usually will find this one. This is made by Brewery Brewerij Martens, uh, a Belgian brewery which is primarily a contract brewery and uh, if you look on rate beer uh, at their beers they have some of the very lowest ratings of any any brewery you can possibly find. Uh, uh, one percentile, some even in zero percentile uh, for their style. So uh, this beer is <clears throat> five percent. Um, it's considered a Belgian ale and uh, Martin's was actually founded in 1758 so they have a very long history but they seem to be primarily a contract brewer at this point. Uh, rate beer, there's only five ratings and the average is uh, 2.96 uh, out of five and on untapped 207 ratings uh, average of 2.51 so a bit lower i have rated this before i gave it a 2.4 out of 5 and but that was uh, about five years ago uh, i don't expect this will have uh, uh, improved at that point but uh, it certainly does have some cute little angels with uh, you know flying over the grain and trying to pick up whatever essence they can of the grain, and let's see how they do. Um, what are the ingredients? It's malt, uh, uh, kind of, uh, it's all together here, barley malt and hops and uh, spirits and tansan gas, uh, forced carbonation, a 5% alcohol. So uh, I expect this is going to be a, a short, nasty, and brutish review. I don't even know why I'm doing it. Why am I doing it? Please tell me. Okay, it is a completely solidly clear, uh, pale, sort of pale straw, medium gold, uh, with about a finger of slightly frothy head. Okay, and what do we get in the aroma? Ah. Uh, grain, just a hint of citrus maybe, some sort of rough, rough sort of fermented fruitiness, uh, stone fruitiness, like a peach that was chopped up and left to sit for a week. Mm. Very mild fruitiness, uh, the uh, spirits are quite evident. Cardboard, absolutely. Uh, yeah, the spirits, a uh, very light, harsh sort of bitterness in the uh, finish. Mm. Wow. Thin body, uh, there's nothing to recommend this beer at all. I'm going to stop right here um, before I kill myself. Uh, this is called Engelchen, uh, Belgian brewery it's supposedly a belgian ale it tastes nothing like a belgian ale uh, it tastes like cardboard that was had some uh, some grain spirits tossed on it really that's basically it um yeah sorry you know but uh gotta do what we gotta do and everything needs to be tried i suppose uh you don't need to try this one though once again it's called angle chen from Brewery Martins, uh, available in Caldi Coffee or not available, depending upon 
uh, your want. Um, that's it for today. We'll try to look at something better in our next review. Uh, hope you're doing well. Take care. Bye-bye.